Yeah, I got it. Right. Oh, sorry. Go first. Can't say it. So you're not here to pick up your car, Nah, I probably could go in there. Hey. I can't get anything, bro. What's up? Just get put out late, right out late. We'll come back there. But as for now, welcome to Walkabout. So, Daniel, what are your thoughts on world democracy? Um, democracy isn't a democracy anyway, so. <laughs> I don't know what you think, but. Well, when are you done, you bet I felt it. You I tried to beat you, but you so hot that I melted. No, I fell right through on. the cry. And now I'm trying to get back Before the cool done run out I'll be giving it my bestest And nothing's going to stop me With divine intervention I reckon it's again my turn To win the sun To learn some I won't hesitate No more No more It cannot wait I'm yours Doesn't matter now, fires don't affect me. Like, fucking, Open up your plans to damn your face. I'm more team. I'm more team. Look into your heart and you'll find love. Hi guys, we're at Port Wakefield and uh, found a nice little jetty. And we're going to give it a bit of a rating. So, jetty. So, we've got the point activity. It's actually currently at a zero status. We did see a copper drive past, but we think it's pretty chill. Can't get down. Population, we're looking at about 250, 300. So, not much of that. Height variation. As you can see, there's zero height variation. It's only about half a metre high, so limits our tricks to a uh, very small. But the scenery is a real time top notch four out of five. Four out of five, we said. Now we cross the first and set the depth analysis. Hey guys, we're about to show you the depth analysis here. So let's find out what we're at. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit of a dark one, but uh, as you can see, it's not very deep. So that limits our tricks to two is, and that's about it. <laughs> Yep, so after the depth analysis, this is about all the tricks we can do on this jetty.
music of the moment come and dance with me. Oh, I love these folk melodies. It's your God for singing around. Biker has just run over what we suspect to be a stumpy-tailed lizard. Uh, he pretended he was dodging it, but clearly... Well, you can see the stuff for yourself. How do you feel, Parker? Shit Killed happens. an innocent animal. Shit happens. Clearly shit happens for this guy. All went out the back end. <laughs> what are your thoughts? Oh, me? That's the killer. Yeah, boy. You got in the way of the truck, you got in the way of the base, that's what happens. Listen to all you lizards out there, don't come near the base. It didn't make it. <laughs> oh. Oh. First casualty. Oh, look at his little kidneys, that's his brain. That's his stomach there, if you open that... Your cormorant. Brendan, you can't just kidnap animals like that. I didn't! I found him! And I took him. It's lies. What are we going to do with it? Well, let's go jelly jumping with it. Hey, welcome to a walkabout jelly jumping session. First one for the trip, or first proper one anyway. Uh, here we are today at Stenhouse Bay Jetty, which is about a 10 minute drive from Marion Bay, which a lot of you already know. Um, we have a really nice jetty today. Really long, quite high, beautiful area, fantastic views. First we're going to look at is height variation. Height variation? Height variation. I should say. There's not much height variation in this jetty. There's one, two, three different heights you can really go from, but that's about it. Um, the height's pretty good though. I'm not going to complain with that. I can I put it in comparison to Brighton Jetty. Uh, the next one is locals here, or cops. I don't see any, and it's a really hard place to get to. We have to go for a bit of a walk to get down here, so they're not going to be an issue. Uh, what else is there? Depth. Depth. We're going to do depth analysis now with JDog Express Player Fresh. He's going to climb down there and make sure it's at least twice our depth. I'll just jump in. Or he can just jump in and if he breaks his neck, we're good. Brenton found a little bird. We decided to call it Sten since we're in Stenhouse Bay. And I'm about to get a car, that's where I'm. And uh, didn't know what to do with it, so now we're going to take it down to Stenhouse Bay. Rhino's tavern, see what they can do with it. Brenton's going to take it in there. It's going to be Brenton's emotional farewell to Sten. We'll see how it goes. Check out the view. 